right guys so we are out here in our greenville location again um, looking at this beautiful fusion home this is a 28 by 76 home this home is actually four bedroom two bath or actually i think it's two and a half bath with an option to add on a fifth bedroom and a third full bath so really really like this i'm just gonna show the front of this one because it is kind of compacted in here but we love this beautiful blue siding with the gray cedar shake above in the dormer and you also have excuse me my camera is doing its own thing you also have these beautiful um trim around the windows that kind of complement the dark uh whenever it comes to this home now we do have white shutters on the ends as well so we really really like that two inch vinyl around that particular window and then white all the way down very clean very modern we love 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 the outside of this house so let's go take a look on the inside all right guys so this house i really really like two features in it it is the kitchen and the master bath so we're gonna save those for last this is your front living room walking in we have vinyl flooring throughout all the main living areas and i'm going to show you all the bedrooms i love this built-in we've got right here you could easily put a 75 inch TV right there and you can run your cables down and there's a plug underneath as you can see there makes your life a whole whole lot easier I love the gray with the white trim absolutely gorgeous this is a beautiful den and dining room so you have your dining room that leads right out here where this sliding glass door is <clears throat> I really like that feature and then you have this beautiful uh, den a really really modern I love the way it turns out I love these white columns on either side and also I love the beautiful uh, gray shadowy gray uh, columns in the ceiling and then we have this gorgeous brick on the fireplace very very clean very modern it's like a sandstone then you have this beautiful uh, barn wood uh, mantle and you have a bookshelf right next to it so I love it, love it, love it, love it. Well, let's go into this first bath bedroom, sorry. So first bedroom here, good size. Not the biggest, but this is the smallest out of the three on this end. This one has a, just a regular closet. You do have plenty of space. So this would be good for, you know, either an office or just a small child's bedroom or just a regular person's bedroom as well. well let's go take a look at this bedroom so another good one this one like i said is got a closet over here so you have kind of identical bedrooms this one of course always has our double pane windows and they fold in for easy cleaning as well now this bathroom is really nice kind of dark in here but it is dual vanity as well you have your shower tub combo down there and then you have a nice linen closet here this one also has a closet at the end of the hallway so tons and tons of storage space on this particular home now this bedroom being the biggest so this will be the oldest child no. <laughs> so you have two double windows here that both fold in then you have a decent sized closet here as well now let's go take a look at one of the three main features i love about this house and that is this laundry room back here guys so you have a huge folding table you have space over here for a freezer plugs are already there then you have your washer and dryer over here you have a nice built-in sink here and you have space to kind of get everything clean and then if you have a big family you have space to hang all of your book bags shoes everything and then if you've been outside playing you don't want to mess up the house you have a half bath right in the uh laundry room right here love 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 that about this house now that we're turned around let's go look at the kitchen also all of our clayton homes come with an ecobee uh, electronic thermostat and that can be controlled by your phone so that's a very very nice up-to-date feature again look at this massive kitchen now this kitchen is a two-tone kitchen so we have our beautiful uh like dark blue cabinets uh on the island there and then you have beautiful barn wood cabinet uh countertop then you also have the two windows here looking right over the sink and you have these beautiful matted gray cabinets that follow throughout the rest of the kitchen now this one does have a stainless steel package with a detachable faucet really really like that and love how beautiful these countertops are this one also has 
a gorgeous rain hood. Oh, I'm sorry, not rain hood. Gorgeous Euro hood for your oven. You do have tons of countertop space and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten outlets in this kitchen. Oh, 11. I found one on the island. <laughs> then you have this beautiful stainless steel double sided refrigerator along with plenty of cabinet and pantry space on either side of it. Now let's go look at my favorite part of this layout is the master. So huge master as you can see. Double pane windows of course. Beautiful, beautiful place. Now we look at the dual vanity. Beautiful outlets. Love the floating shelves. Beautiful sinks. That gray cabinetry continued out into here. And bang! We've got a huge shower. So we've got this huge Beautiful shower that has a mosaic lined tile and you have the Amazon rain head there and you also have this giant soaker tub with a floating shelf above it. You can't really see it but it's right there. Then we have this massive closet that runs the full length of the bathroom. So let's join me in the kitchen for final details. All right, so I am in the beautiful Clayton Appalachia Fusion home. This is a 76 foot home. It is a four bedroom, two and a half bath home with an option to add a fifth bedroom and three full bathrooms. So I will plop in a layout right here. You've seen that layout, so you can kind of get it a bit. <laughs> you kind of get a full view of what this home is about and sweating to death because it's a hundred million degrees in this house anyways um this home we again like we said last week we're not able to develop any pricing just because prices have gone absolutely crazy and um we're not for sure exactly what you need on your piece of property or if you need property both of those we can help you with now we really appreciate you guys watching. Give us a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.